We got Raven. We got Leah, which doesn't have a trail name yet. And we got Logan, who are all gonna get their trail names this weekend. As we're up here in Manistee, you no. Know, With the town of uh, near Messick. Messick, Michigan. So we'll be doing the North Country Trail heading southbound, uh, where we will probably do about, I believe, nine or 10 miles down southward, where we'll hook up into the Manistee River Trail and head back northbound. We're doing this on Friday, May 10th, and we'll be here the 10th, 11th, and 12th, finishing up the morning of the 12th. Alright guys, just make sure to follow the blue blazes. The blue blazes on this loop, guys. And it's beautiful, peaceful, and serene out here. I think it's gonna get a little more nervy. All right, we are now at the suspension bridge uh, where you can either follow the Manistee River Trail that direction or we're gonna cross the suspension bridge which leads you right to the North Country Trail. So we're gonna go this route. We're gonna take the North Country Trail south. Down, it's gonna loop around and we're gonna come back up north on the Manistee River Trail. To get from the campground to here is roughly 1.35 miles uh, so 1.35 miles is gonna bring you to the suspension bridge you're gonna have the map here that kind of tells you what you got and what you don't have North Country Trail straight ahead Alrighty, so we are now going to be getting on the North Country Trail. And guys, as we hike along, this is the Manistee River. Look at this. Beautiful day. We are celebrating our 34th wedding anniversary and Mother's Day because one of my sons is with me. So for me, it's an anniversary slash Mother's Day celebration. So you come to a fork in the road and you're just like, okay. All right. That way. So we are going straight ahead. North Country Trail, south. Sometimes you have signage. What do you do? No, okay, no. There you go, guys. We're now hiking on a road. Just keep following the signs for the North Country Trail. Come off the road, get back on the trail. That just came right out. Oh. Interesting. And that is a morel. We're gonna find out what the name is. Okay, I'm let's... Mushroom man. <laughs> you oh. are the mushroom, mushroom man. man. <laughs> so here we are at Eddington Creek. Rattler, how far are we in? From the campground, we are about 3.36 miles in. And if you want to take it from the suspension bridge, we're about two miles. Yeah, so we're heading in from the Seton Creek. Seton, Seton Creek Campground, and we are going on the North Country Trail. This is the first and only water source on the North Country Trail in the loop that we're doing, 22 mile loop. Our campsite for the night, guys. 
five and a half miles from Seton Creek Campground. Gathering wood to start a fire. Life is good. I think it would have been that much extra in the, in the wheat, honestly. Zero. <laughs> That's four hundred. No. Oh, no, wouldn't that be more? No, that's right. No, three is 200, that's 400. Oh. Built in stove top. Yeah. All right. Hot water, guys? Yeah. All right. All right. Good morning, everybody. It is almost noontime here in Michigan. Day two of our hike, only five miles in, but we plan on doing about 10 miles today. It has turned into a beautiful blue sunny sky day. Last night, a lot of thunderstorms. We were supposed to be able to see the Aurora Borealis, but due to the inclement weather, we were not able to, uh, and it put us into our tent a little early last night. So here we are getting started. All right, so we are about 1.5 miles in. So far on the North Country Trail, heading southbound. And it is a pretty decent trail. Uh, it is definitely well marked. As you can see, see the tree up ahead, you'll see the blue blaze. Uh, Michigan, uh, Michigan Federal and State Parks have done a phenomenal job on marking them out so you don't get lost out here. There's the blaze I'm talking about. Uh, and the trail overall has been beautiful. Uh, today's turned out to be a nice day. The rain has moved on. And we are just enjoying the beauty here, so. All right, guys, there is a campsite out there, right there. And here is Sheep Ranch Road. The goal yesterday was to make it this far, but we only went five and a half from the campground because uh, we just found a really nice site for all three of our tents. But this is uh, two miles from where we camped last night. It's like the trees the tree. I know, right? <laughs> That's so cool. All right, everybody, it is 5.68 miles in from our campsite where we started, uh, roughly 10.68 from the campground, and we are still on the North Country Trail, but as you see, we come to a fork in the road where it is properly marked that we are going to head to the Manistee River Trail, Upper River Trailhead. So signage is good. You can't get lost. All right, guys, here we are. On the Manistee River Trail, just want to show you here another fork. If you go north, it'll take you to North Country Trail, which we were just on. Go straight ahead for the Manistee River Trail. And here is the Upper River Trailhead. Uh, this is where, this is another place where you can park um, to hit this loop. And I believe this is a parking lot or space that there is no fee. Uh, we did have to pay eight dollars a day at Seedon Creek Campground, but this is a free parking area if you decide to do this loop. So this is where you would, this is the trail you would take to get onto the loop, and we are going to keep going on the Manistee River Trail, going to the Red River Bridge. All right, all right, here we are at the Red Bridge River Access in Manistee National Forest. Uh, where we are at the red bridge, which you can see is not red, but uh, we are roughly about from the campground. We are roughly about 11.95 miles in. And for those faint at heart that don't like to 
used to wash them in the woods. There is actually a nice bathroom along with picnic tables and probably a water source uh, to fill up, have lunch, use the bathroom and enjoy some quick R&R. &R. See the Manistee River Trail. We zoom in on the map. Now we'll be on the side of the river that has an abundance of campgrounds. So we're gonna go up this way and you can see all the campgrounds 10B, oh. 10A. All the nine, black and red eight, diamonds are all campsites. All these red are all designated campsites. So, I believe that this side of the river is going to be roughly about 10 miles. Ten and a half miles long, so we gotta get started to get another couple miles in, so we have a shortened day for tomorrow. Yeah, so we started over here at the Seed Creek Campground. If you wanna get that, honey, we started here at the Seed Creek Campground. We crossed the suspension bridge and we jumped on the North Country Trail, which is this red dot, all the way down here. And now we're here at the Red Bridge River Access, and we're heading up north now to get back to Seed Creek where we're parked. All right. All right. Sounds good. So here we go. We're off. Let's get All right, guys. As we make our way back up the Manistee River Trail, we come up to Arquilla Creek. Uh, the water sources on this side are supposed to be abundant. And as you can see, it's clear, fastly moving, and a great water source. <laughs> <laughs> and we are waiting for the other two to try to catch up. Uh, along this side of the trail, there is a lot of camping sites. They're all numbered, actually starting at 1 A, B, C, D, all the way to 10 A, B, C, D. And right now we're in the 9 category as we make our way back north to our car. At least the wind's died down a little bit now. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, wouldn't I need a scuba diving license? No. Don't they have you in a scuba gear? Yeah, but you're in a case you're not scuba diving really. Then you have a button that fills it up with air to bring you back to the top. You gotta be able to watch your air and know your depth. And spot to be doing it. Perfect. Today is Sunday, May 12th, and we're on the last leg of our trail heading back to the campground to make our way home. There's Raven. Good morning, everyone. And we have trail names for our two new people. We have Morel and we have Beefsteak. <laughs> so we're getting ready to finish this leg up. It's going to be about six to seven miles.
This is the waterfall on the Manistee River Trail, guys. It's near the Sioux, the 2C campsite. All right, we're coming to the end. Let's keep a trucking. And here we are at the tail end of the hike. We get this nice heart pumping hill. Finalize out our weekend excursion. Anything to say, Raven? <laughs> All right, that sums it up, guys. The North Country Trail, Manistee River Trail. I'd rate it as moderate, fun, beautiful, and uh, definitely recommend. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.